Uh, hey guys, uh, well, this is uh, another Mac versus, not really a Mac versus PC video, but it is uh, uh, on the Mac and tech world. But, you know, uh, well, uh, basically, I've brought another update about the Mac. First off, you know, I always wanted to get the MacBook Pro. That was my first Mac I wanted, but I never really got around to that because I got my, my mom bought me a laptop ready for Black Friday. After that, uh, you know, now I'm saving up for the Mac, iMac, and I still am, so don't worry about that. But I've been putting my money into that and uh, online revenue into that and some spare change into tech equipment, other stuff like microphones, stuff like that. But anyways, guys, I was looking around eBay, and I'm thinking about picking up with some spare change. This won't dent my iMac one, like $40, $50, or even up to $100 wouldn't really, it, I guess 100 could dent it, but not like a huge dent. Like, I'm not blowing out like 300 bucks because, you know, uh, most I would spend, you know, uh, out of the iMac fund, I would only spend up maybe to 100 bucks. That's about it, because I can make uh, money online, so I'm making some good money online as an online revenue, and that's going all to the iMac, no, nothing of that is being spent on equipment. But, um, now, uh, I'm thinking about, you know, not, uh, I'm also thinking about picking up a G, iMac G3 or G4, possibly, just to, to play around with, you know, probably just have a uh, 10.4 Tiger installed onto it, just to play around with and put it up. Uh, we're talking about the old CRT, where everything's built in, the translucent ones. Uh, but uh, I did come across what I something I was planning on buying in the midst of the MacBook Pro and the iMac, and I can still pick this up and get the iMac later on. But this I might be able to get quicker. And I'm talking about uh, a little mini, a lot of leverage. You know what that means? So of course, the Mac Mini. Now this, of course, was a really great small Mac. You know, it's minimal, uh, minimal space, so it won't take up a lot of space. It's a really great desktop. They Apple did a great job on build, building this. And uh, I'm not sure if I'm gonna order it Apple off Apple.com. It's a little bit too much, maybe off like eBay or something. Cause uh, uh, I've been talking to my parents about my dad, especially about online, and he said I have to talk to him about what I want to buy before I can buy it. If so, I can put my money, my I make in like, you know, like doing stuff out. You know, not, I shouldn't say real world, but you know, where I live, making money out there and transfer it to online credit, I guess you could say. And uh, I'm planning on, I'm thinking about it now, so it's not, you know, for sure, but I still am getting the iMac. Uh, you know, mark my words, I still really want that 24 inch iMac, and someday I will get that, so, uh, especially the online revenue. But, you know, and they're not that much, that's why, but I don't want to order it off Apple. Because it will be a lot, but if I do have to end up doing that, if I do get a lot of extra money, I would, I would probably only have like 2 gigs of RAM, 120 gigabyte hard drive, uh, no no keyboard or accessories, stuff like that, uh, no iWork, just that, and maybe a protection plan, but without the protection plan, it would be around 824. So that is a little costly, but I can get it also off eBay, stuff like that. Uh, I saw a good one right here, it's 255 bucks. It is a really good seller. He has 99.6 positive feedback. Plus he has a lot of other sales that he's come through with. And uh, it's the Intel Core Two Duo, Intel Core Duo, 1,600 megahertz. Hard drive is only 80 gigabytes, but it's running 10.4. And I can buy a Leopard and uh, pick that up and you know uh, install it on here. And it's a used one. There is no screen. Memory is 768 megabytes. That's just a cheap one. And plus it comes with a power supply, Wi-Fi, Bluetooth, DVD. Uh, ultra thin, the new ultra thin keyboard and the mighty mouse, and uh, one far and yeah, and the Apple remote, etc., etc. And there's other people out there selling uh, stuff. The Mac Mini. There's some cheaper ones, but they're not the Core Two Duo. I'm, I'm trying to look for a Core Two Duo, but if not, I'll result to the old G4, uh, the older processor models. And there's stuff like hmm, there's some cheaper ones. There's a two, and there's another one down here that's 102 bucks. It's a Mac Mini 1.5 gigahertz, 80 gig hard drive, but only 512 megabytes. You know, I'm not gonna really need an intense Mac Mini. Just really want to try out Leopard. And what I'm gonna do is hook up a KVM switch. Uh, I'm gonna buy a KVM, maybe 50, 40 dollars, not that much, around there, and hook it up to my monitor, my new flat screen, my old, not new, but old one, and put Mac Mini and my de and my Windows XP in a dual boot type of uh, form, so I can just switch between the KVMs. As keyboard video monitor. Basically, I won't need a new keyboard. I won't need a new video or monitor. But if not, 
And I'm thinking maybe I can put the CRT, this Dell one, maybe uh, find a way to move some stuff off my desk. Because I think I could fit the, I may add an extra one of my old tables, put the laptop on there, put this uh, old Samsung Cynic 17 inch on this desk, plus a CRT. The CRT will run Windows, and the 17 inch will run the Mac Mini, just in case I don't, if I don't get the KDM, and I, because if I do buy uh, this Mac Mini with the keyboard and stuff, there won't be really, you know, a reason for these launch tech mouses and keyboard. Then again, I can always hook it up to my laptop, so I'll still see about that. But guys, like I said, it's not for sure. Uh, I've really been trying to raise money for the iMac and some Tech World, you know, for Tech World and stuff like that. Uh, new equipment for Tech World and the Mac, especially for Tech World, because I got a lot of Apple viewers out there, a lot of Apple users. And you know, I've I've opened up donations. So if you want to donate, you know, I'm not saying you don't you don't have to. You know, it's okay if not. But if you do like Tech World, you really want to see some new products out there, some reviews. And if you just you know. I don't care how much you donate, but if you want to donate, uh, just e email me at kidgurucenter at gmail.com or kidgurucenter at yahoo, or even at my YouTube account, and I'll give you the information to where you can donate, and just, you know, send me a uh, letter saying how much you want to donate, etc., etc., and, you know, if you do donate, thanks, if not, it's okay, uh, like I said, you don't have to, but anyways, if you do, that'd be cool, because uh, it'll go towards the Mac fund, of course, and, yeah, so guys, that's what I wanted to talk about today. I'm thinking of picking up a Mac Mini, not sure, because, you know, the online shopping is really a new thing to me. Not really new, but, you know, I've really started ever since I got my ThinkGeek stuff. So. so, guys, um, hmm. But, yeah, I'm looking to get pretty much cheap one. If not, I might get a G4 iMac. I know it's a little more costly and install Leopard on there, but, you know, I, I might be able to find a cheaper one. Anyways, guys, I'll get back to you, but, again, if you want to donate or anything like that, you can reach me at kidgurucenter at gmail.com or kidgurucenter at yahoo.com or even at YouTube. That's just a new thing I've opened with a, uh, you can do it PayPal however you want, you know, whatever is the securest way for you. Just email me and I'll, talk, uh, I'll get back to you on that. So those are some tech world updates, some Mac updates. Anyways guys, thanks for watching.